So this whole advert started with Bob coming to me and basically saying, Caleb, I wanna do something big for the Springboks. I committed fully to it. I told her, we're gonna have tackles, we're gonna have lineouts, we're gonna have scrums. I think I decided to go much bigger than she was anticipating. We only had an hour to shoot and there were 12 people involved, uh, 14, 15 people involved if you actually count people behind the camera as well. So this was quite a large crowd to only film in one hour. So we had to be really tight on time, but we wanted to have a lot of fun as well. And that was what was so great about this mini production is that even though we were so stressed for time, even though we had very few resources, we had such a great time. And I think the final product was really, really good. Uh, I was the ball catcher and I was the guy running away from the spring box all the way down the hallway and that the, the beautiful slow-mo hair, if I can say that. There was a scene where um, Wesley, the big spring box guy, uh, tackled me through the door. The amount of times we had to reshoot that scene because I would get tackled into the door frame. I've got a lot of bruises on my knees and that for that shot, but anything for the shot. I've never really done a line-up before, so I had to learn that skill very quickly and I just hoped for the best when I threw that ball to the tallest people. <laughs> So uh, the position that I played was essentially the guy that was running while holding people on my back. I also ended up trying to tackle Clooms, but he actually just dragged me around the office on his back. I did my elbows and I also fell through the door <laughs> in Ari's office. <laughs> so we had done that run where I ran into the lady that was holding the papers that all flew over and Jonathan was like, <gasps> that, yeah. I did that first one, but it wasn't, it was almost expressionless. So I put on the expression that I thought was appropriate for this. And I thought that I was already being extra with this expression and everything and the way I was sounding. And he was like, look, that was great, but I need you to put more into it. I need you to run super exaggerated. I need you to make your face look stupid. And I said, for you brother, say less. <laughs> <laughs> the comedy lies in, in you know, your facial expressions and, and the over-exaggerated nature of this entire sequence. So he really committed, not just to the running, but to, to dragging the spring box on his back. And I did this, I don't know what came out, I just did. Whole time, wasn't even thinking about it. And then looking back at it, it's like, oh my goodness. <laughs> Still pretty great though, I enjoyed it. Uh, I did the guy that did the winning try. Brendan is another example of someone who fully committed to his part. Dude dove onto a concrete floor. Not once, not twice, three times, so that we could get all the shots we needed. Oh, amazing. Committed hard, but you know what? That's what the book could do, we commit hard with the depth we've got in our squad. There's a lot of laughs. I think it was hard to actually not laugh and try and keep serious, but yeah, it was lots of fun. I really enjoyed making the video. It was so much fun. Even though it was during our lunch break, we had a hell of a good time. It was a fun and wholesome experience, and I'm glad that I got to interact with some of my colleagues more than usual. But at the end of the day, I think everyone really put it all together because we're all truly passionate about South Africa. We really, really want to support the Springboks and they are right now representing our country, which we really, really love. Oh, I loved every part of it. It was actually so fun to be included. Let's go, Boca! 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 We behind yous.